Oh, you're going to pile the misery on, are you? You're going to, you're going to really, oh, you are. Oh, Billy Big Bollock's going to pull, pull the misery down on little old Inkly. We'll see, mate. We'll see. What is going on, guys? FMU here. Welcome back. Uh, yeah, it's FA Cup day. FA Cup day. First round, FA Cup. We got here before and got tanks 8 1. So we've not got a great record, let's be honest. Let, let's put all our cards on the table. Uh, but today we've got Wickham Wanderers. And it, they're from League 2, they're fifth. And it's going to be. Oh, stretch. Let's have a stretch. Let's just relax a minute and take a, take a second to have a little stretch. Oh, yeah, stretch it all out. That's it. That's nice. Yeah, apparently uh, apparently they're going to do us. So uh, we'll, we'll have a look at that in a minute. And uh, they probably will, to be fair. Um, let's face it. But uh, first of all, it's the return of something I'm sure you'll be happy with. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, I am here to introduce to you... The Results Roundup! We followed the last game against Nuneaton with a two... Uh, sorry, we know we beat Nuneaton 2-0. I'm, I'm rusty at the results round up there with me, for Christ's sake. Uh, we beat uh, Blythe Spartans by three goals still in the third qualifying round of the FA Cup. Uh, Fisher, well and truly, uh, having a Boston season. And then Junior Morris, uh, Mariah, sorry, uh, with his two goals, fully deserved, fully in control. Bang on the door of the first round. If we manage to get through the fourth round qualifier of course <laughs> yeah that was followed in the league by no no draw with Kettering disappointing performance uh, but as we seem to do in every game win lose or draw we dominated this uh, this match and just couldn't get the ball in the back of the net disappointed draw but happy to get at least a point I guess in the fourth round qualifier, we managed to go to Lincoln and beat them by three goals to one. They were pretty poor, to be honest. Uh, they did get one through uh, Callum Pritchard Ellis, but they were no match for us, really. We, we out muscled them, out powered them, out passed them, out played them in every sense of the word and fully deserved to reach the first round proper. Then these buggers turned up. We cannot beat Mickelover for love nor money. Um, in what was a more even game, but we still dominated, if that makes sense, we lost 2-0. Uh, goals from Davis and Tracy for them. An injury to Mitch Williams wasn't very serious. And a booking for Cameron Dix. Uh, disappointed to lose that. It's a game we should be winning. Then the top two collided in the division. Hinkley top, Salford second. Salford won, despite our absolute obvious dominance. We were way better than them throughout the entire game. The difference was they could score when we freaking well couldn't. Simple as peas. So, yes, yes, yes. That leaves us on a run of two defeats. Uh, we haven't won in the league in three now. Shock horror. Um, not very good. I think it's three anyway. Three or four. I just have a quick little double check. Oh yeah, bow bow. Yeah, we haven't won in three in the league, which is a mini dip for us, I guess. Um, finance is still looking very healthy. Very pleased with that. Really pleased with that. Uh, managing to hold on to it. The Liagua table is still looking very promising for us at the moment. We're still ahead just um, with 32 points and 13 goal difference. Three better than uh, Salford. Uh, Kidderminster to creeping up the table now. Um, Alfredton lifting themselves off the bottom, hence we're dropping down to the bottom. And it's it's um, yeah, it's been an all right season so far. Alex Bruce has t has, has been sacked by Southport. I'll just give you a second to say that in. Wow, not done very well at all, my friend. Um, how are Biggles Wade doing? Let's have a look at them. They're still bottom. They're still well and truly shitted out. Um, there you go. They're they're gonna finish bottom, aren't they? They ain't gonna survive nothing. They're gonna be in trouble for the season, I think. Um, and blah, 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 blah. a few more little faces have come in. That guy came in, Alex Whitmore. My goodness, face. 
Uh, then John Rooney. That's right. John Rooney has come in on a free. He is uh, the brother of Wayne Rooney, for those of you who do not know. He's joined on a free. Not had quite the glittering career his brother has. Close, but not quite. And Colin Doyle, goalkeeper. Oh, yeah. He is going to displace this miserable son of a bitch. Springthorpe's been fantastic when he's played, uh, which has been nearly every game. But his attitude is dirt rock bottom. So Colin Doyle's come in. And uh, I think I'm going to throw out Mr. Springthorpe from the first team. Maybe not in the... I don't know. I think maybe we should in the cup game. Curtis Guthrie. Wow. Hey, Ruby. He is a good player at this level. He would do a decent job. He could play up top. Sorry to football's doing his usual... Just having a look at plays for me, making offers, and I'll decide I always have the final word. But today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going into the FA Cup without our dick. Our dicks is injured, our dicks is limp. Today, um, okay, so I reckon it's Doyle in goal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, it's had the old swap around. Happy Gilmore's lost his place. Uh, Mitch on the bench. Go with Andre Brown up top, but I'm going to put Marias up top. Former Wickham player, a little something to prove. You know, you know how it is. So, there, yeah, and Taylor's available, which is good. I don't, I, I like Taylor to be available for the youth teams, and he um, and goes out there and he plays for them. So sometimes he's not available for the first team, but I'm okay with that, because it's helping his, you know, his progression. He's helping his progression as a player. But there he is, oh Marvin Benteke. Don't know how he's doing. Don't really. I'm not going to look into it. We're not looking. No, nope. Well, they got Kevin Van Veen up front. He knows how to ping a ball in. That's for sure. Edna Stevens, uh, Sam Slocum in goal. Who's on the bench from Anthony Stewart, former crew defender Rene Matthews, Alexander Arnold, Ball Harvey. Joe Jacobson and Alabi. They've got some good players, and they do. They really, in all fairness, should wipe the floor with us. On paper. This isn't on paper, it's on AstroTurf. And uh, when it's on AstroTurf, anything can happen. And you can take that to the bank as they nearly score literally within 33 seconds. Oh, man alive. We've had a lot of possession, we haven't done nothing with it yet. Come on. Come on, that's it. Well done. Go on. Here's Jones now. Can he swing a ball in? No, he can't. He kind of lost that a bit pitifully. Oh, they're in, and they've hit the post. Oh, I thought I was going to be a goal there. Very lively all of a sudden. Very lively. Clovis Camjo seems to just stop everything there. Stop. Hammer time. Are they going to score? They are. It's offside. I laugh at their offsideness. Ha 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 ha. That's how I laugh. Uh, come on, let's have them now. Let's, that's it. Put a few. Oh, shorty, what are you doing, son? Come on, man. Goal, no, not yet. Well, Doyle's um, earning his money in this opening game for us. Let's put it that way. Come on, boys. Oh, are you joking me? Oh, I thought it was an own goal. Still, George Savile, former Chelsea player. He's put the ball in the back of that, and I forgot to put the fecking highlights back on, so I apologise. I'm sorry to. I'm sorry I've let everybody down. Um, right, okay. Assertively, show me something in the second half, because you were pretty fucking shit, to be honest. You were a much better team than you are letting on. Now go out there and do something about it, you little shit. That's what I said to them. That's what I'd tell them. It would work. Go on. Is it? He's not work. Question is, oh, they're in again. Oh, oh, woo! That was close. I thought we were going to have a bit of a problem there. Rodden well Whitmore. Try not to pass the ball across the feck in front of goal. That's a good idea. Oh, man, what is Short doing today? One more ice. Go! For the Former Wicker Man! Get there, feckin'. Beautiful ball from Fisher. Look at this. 
just stops everything and then just oh beautiful outside of the foot just pings it past the keeper that is cool that is calm that's collective they're gonna go straight down the other end and score so it counts for shit really here they go football manager you predictable fucker I don't like it. Oh, he saved it so beautifully as well. Oh, damn. Damn, Sean. Right, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, we're doing this. We're gonna go for it. We're just gonna go for it. We're gonna we're gonna go hell for leather, bitches. So you can go there. Rooney can come into the middle because Short's been piss poor. Short's been terrible, so you can go in there. And Crooks. Rooney. Good sir. You passionately you're gonna make a difference. You passionately gonna make a difference. See? Motivational genie arse, is that what I am? Is Come on. I don't know why I sit here going, come on, come on, as if they can hear me. Come on, come on, that's it. That's nice. Kick him. Oh, Van Veen's wrapped it up. You absolute piss basket. Well, I mean, it's it's understandable, you know, the, the, the difference in class and level between the two clubs. It's understandable that they're going to come here and beat us quite easily. But I'm just very disappointed with the passing and movement of our players. I mean, Short, who is normally spot on, bang on with his passing, has been absolutely atrocious from start to finish. Doyle's done well. I know he's conceded three goals, but he's done very, very well. I think if Dix had been playing as well, we'd have we'd have done a lot better defensively, and that was woeful. Absolutely woeful. I'm I'm no, I'm not happy with the way they played. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Johnny Boy. I'm not giving him that. No, I'm far from pleased. I think today was a very brilliant opportunity for them to show the world what they're capable of, live on telly, and they've just rolled over and had their arseholes tickled. And I don't like it. I don't like it at all. And in the next match against Stourbridge, I hope we absolutely bash them into the next week. You owe, These players have got to prove something to me now, because that I know against a team from a couple of divisions above, I know they're doing well in their league, but a bit more fight. I mean, come on, guys. You know, what's what's going on? I mean, do you enjoy being pissed on by a team do you really like it you can fuck off mate because when you come in you shit uh last time i gave you a chance you didn't give me any reason that's not fair <laughs> life's not fair bitch um no let's not ask like this if it means that much to you prove it yeah no disrespect intended assertively uh, i'm your manager what i say goes yeah you little pansy He's back down. Bitch. You bitch! He was terrible the last time I played him, so I'll probably give him a game against Stab Stab Bridge now. I'm harsh on them and then I'm like, okay. Alright then. Now I've beaten you down. Now I've emasculated you in front of the rest of the dressing room. I'll give you a game. Under my thumb, that's what you are. Uh, but guys, that's it for today's episode. Unfortunately, we were shite, so I'm sorry. I really apologise for that. I really do. Uh, next episode, not sure when we're going to come in. This was a bit of a bonus one. Look at that, 1,472 people. That's a decent gate at home. Happy with that. Um, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to come in with the next episode, guys. Like I said, I want to try and get a season a bit out of the way a bit quicker. Didn't expect us to get to the first round of the FA Cup. That's why I've had this little bit of a bonus. But, guys, I'm out of time. Uh, please remember to hit the like button if you enjoyed this episode and you want to continue to see this wonderful, magical journey we're on. If not, don't, and it'll disappear. Simple as that. Like magic, it will disappear. Uh, guys, been a pleasure being in your face. Bye-bye.